Hey, what's going on? Ryland here in the Garage Gym, and I'm going to talk about a couple of our Tidal boxing bags. I haven't done a review on these, and there's not much information out there on YouTube. I know when I was looking, it was hard to find anything. So um, I figured I better just throw some info out there. There's not a lot to say, but I've got a few uh, few things to share on these. I've had these for a couple of years now, and they are hard to beat. So let's get into it. The first bag here is a title bag. It's called the Big Bang 3.0. It's a weird name, I know. Um, but there's a 3.0, and I believe there's also a 2.0. I haven't been on the website in a little while, but that should give you uh, an idea. Now, the 2.0 is the older version, if I remember, and it has a lanyard on the bottom here that you can tie down and hook it up to a, a, a weight or something on the bottom to keep it from swinging around. This is an angled bag, so it allows you to do a lot of work, a lot of angles, work a lot of uppercuts, and it's a little bit lighter weight, so it's gonna move around a little bit more, but it's a great bag. I really like having this bag in addition to our a tie bag over here. So this one here is the title tie bag 3.0 and it's also the soft strike version. So well we'll talk about the soft strike version. That's one of the big questions when I was looking at buying one of these bags. I saw the word soft strike and I want that. Do I want that? What's the difference? Honestly, in all the bags, I've been hitting bags for a long time all over, the, all over the place in different gyms and different brands. The soft strike thing to me is a bit of a marketing thing because it feels exactly the same as just about any heavy bag I've ever hit. So it might be a touch softer, but honestly, don't expect when you get this bag to feel super soft when you're hitting it. You're, you're, it's gonna feel like a normal bag, at least until you break it in. Um, but it's a great bag for the money. You really can't beat Title Boxing's bag um, prices. They're absolutely awesome with the shipping. And when I was shopping, I ended up with going with Title, and I'm happy I did. I've been really happy with these. Like I said, we've had these for a couple years. I try to box twice a week, and they just last and they work. They're not maybe set up for full on commercial boxing clubs, but for a home use, homeowner type use, amateur stuff, they'll work just fine. And again, the prices are great. Um, this one here, I don't kick it as often as I should, so I can't say too much about you know using it for kicks and stuff, but it's really designed for that type of training where you can do Thai, uh, Mu Thai on this or kickboxing. Um, but it works really well, it's a nice bag, and I got no complaints on it, it's been fine. The uh, bags in the gym are on a rail system. That's how I'm able to move them around. We can move the bags anywhere in the gym here. And I have a video if you wanna set up your own rail system on how to do that. Check it out, it's in my videos. I'll see if I can link it. I'm not sure how to do that, but I'll, I'll try to link it in this one. And one other thing I wanna mention is if you're hanging any type of heavy bags or an aqua bag in your gym, at home or anywhere, Grab one of those uh, springs, those cushion springs work so good. They just keep everything from, from moving around and bouncing around. We've all hit bags where the chains are always constantly making noise and those springs will help alleviate all that. And I'll put a picture of what they look like. I think they're about $12. You can get them on Amazon. The brand doesn't really matter. One more tip when you're buying from Title Boxing is search for coupon codes. There's always codes out there for 20% off. If you're smart, you can search around and find those um, and also look for sales. Uh, so you can get a pretty good deal if you're able to be patient, catch a sale, use a coupon code, etc. So again, these are great bags. We've had them for a couple years and no complaints, no issues. I think it's the best value in the market in the boxing game for, uh, for bags right now. So thanks for watching. If you have any questions about these bags or reviews that we're doing or the gym that we have, put them in the comments below. I'll gladly uh, answer those questions for you. And again, thanks for watching. And if you're a subscriber, we appreciate the support. So have a good day. See ya.